collection of golf courses so varied, amazing attractions, and of course, wonderful accommodations. All of this in an area that you can get to from anywhere. Now, once you do get there, you're gonna need a tour guide to get to all of these different locations. That's where Golf Pack Travel comes in, our personal tour guide. And we'll have it all for you on this latest episode of The Traveling Golfer. One moment changes everything. Distance, precision, decided in a microsecond. So reduce your ball spin and get the most performance at impact with four yards more. A next-gen golf tee proven by pros and players like you. The unique durable design flexes at contact, reducing ball spin, giving you tighter control and more distance. So change your game and get four yards more. Brought to you by Greenkeepers. Golf smart. Golf's fairways just got wider and par fives a lot shorter. Thanks to Bridgestone's new E12 Contact, featuring a unique contact force dimple design that delivers 38% more contact and impact. Think straight, think distance. Play Bridgestone's new E12 Contact. We are at the happiest place on turf Walt Disney World Golf with Alex Forsythe, the Director of Sales and Marketing. In October 2021, we were beginning to celebrate the 50th anniversary of Walt Disney World Golf. It's a huge celebration for us, and we've got a, a lot on the books as we continue that celebration. All three of the championship golf courses that we've got, they are PGA Tour caliber golf courses. We played host to the PGA Tour for 40 plus years from signs on the tee boxes to uh, the Champions Pavilion at Palm and Magnolia where you see all the past PGA Tour winners. We're very proud of that PGA Tour history. Would you term these courses typical Florida? Uh, yes and no. The Lake Bonavista golf course has a different nature and ambiance to that of Palm and Magnolia. And by that, I mean playability of the golf courses. The look and the aesthetics are certainly Floridian in nature as they were designed originally by Joe Lee back in the late 60s, early 70s. You either have holes uh, where you have houses or resorts on one side or the other, and water comes into play about nine of those 18 holes. But when you go over to the Palm and the Magnolia golf courses, you are backing up onto an area of wilderness. You see a lot of wildlife and you don't play in amongst the resorts that you would at the Lake Bonavista golf course. And you feel the tranquility out there and amongst it. Walt Disney World golf is all about fun. So we brought Mickey in to join us with Alex. And I'm going to guess you bring a lot of people here on packages. We have a special deal for those that are traveling with Golf Pack Travel to visit here in Orlando. If you play all three golf courses here at Walt Disney World, all three championship courses, you can go home with a golf shirt, complimentary golf shirt with Mickey on the chest, nice memento to take home to your family. Patrick Dill, director of golf, Champions Gate, 36 holes of Greg Norman architectural mastery. Norman worked with the land, didn't move a lot of dirt, used the natural features, and gave us two different golf courses, the national, the international. And I didn't even need my passport for that, so it was a good thing. <laughs> years and years and years ago was a citrus grove, and another part of the property was a cattle farm. Um, so you've got two really unique pieces of property and land. The National is a little more uh, an American style golf course, narrow fairways, really large bunkers, really fun, great resort experience, real popular with our members. Uh, the International Golf Course, there's not a lot of trees. So when it's windy, it's really challenging, a really <laughs> difficult golf course. I've been there on a couple of those days. Yeah, it can be brutal when it's windy. Uh, you know, you could have a two, three club wind. With a link style, you've got a lot of runoff areas, so you have a lot of options with your short game to choose. Bump and run, run it up, you can flop it up. You, you know, there's some real um, unique ways to play the golf. 
total go off resort operations uh, 896 rooms with the omni resort um, some villas some condos um, so you've got a lot of options for lodging here right on property it's, uh, tied with some great community opportunities so uh, a really neat concept that has been in the works for a long time reach out to golf pack travel and they'll put you in touch with patrick dill and get you to champions gate Ryan Hosper, director of golf at one of my favorite places, Shingle Creek. Ryan, this property keeps getting better. And it seems to have the total package. Definitely. The location is, is top notch. The, it's a championship 18 hole golf facility, plenty of natural wildlife. Every time I have played here, and luckily it's been a number, the conditions are absolutely optimum, and that makes for a great experience. We really strive day in, day out to provide optimal playing conditions year round. It's one of those things that if you come in here in July, we'd like you to have just as good a time as if you came here in January. These Tiff Eagle greens are fun to putt, and I love the close mown areas around there that allow for a lot of shot options. It's one of those things where once you've played here a lot, you learn that putting off the fringes and collars is actually to your benefit. It's very closely mown. It makes it, makes it easier for the amateur golfer, but yet provides a challenge for the, the good golfer. This 18th hole right here, of course, comes in with the impressive hotel behind it. It really is a dramatic finish to the golf course. But if you had one other hole that you wanted to point out, what might it be? I would say the drivable par four, number 14. It's, it's a risk reward. It's one of those, those great holes that we did on the, the Arnold Palmer redesign. And I love watching people play that hole and decide whether to go for broke or play it safe. Yeah, a little bit of excitement into the round. You've got it all right here. You've got holes that are wide open so you can let it loose with the driver. You've got a couple others you gotta sort of think your way around a little bit. It's a great mix of holes as this Shingle Creek has developed over the years. It's a lot of changes, but the changes were all good ones. And then we got the exclusive Golf Pack Travel merchandise voucher that you'll receive for coming and playing here. Just wanted to make sure there was a green behind there. These walls are intimidating and if it looks a little bit more like Scotland than Orlando it's going to sound even more because we have managing partner Kenny Nairn with us from Scotland. Thanks Tony, thanks for having you. It's great to be here with you at Eagle Creek, a golf course that is so popular because of its location. Most of our golf pack customers they love it because it's a golf course that they either fly into, play in the afternoon or play in the morning and fly out. Uh, so it's great accessibility, we've got fabulous showers in there, so there's no, no problem in having any issues when you jump on board that plane. You know, it's par 73, which is unique for Florida, it's the only one in Florida uh, with par 73. It's fantastic, lots of hills, wide open fairways where the ball runs like a link style golf course. It also gives you a little bit of a background on these bunkers, yep. which are a very unique style. The revetted faces is turf layered on top of each other to create more, more like a vertical face. So, you know, if you can get out the first time, maybe knock it out backwards or <laughs> the old adage of pick up the hand and throw it out. Revetted bunkers, it is something that really is predominant in Scotland, Ireland. I have Kenny Nairn to show us the way to get out of these riveted bunkers. My tip is really quite simple. If you're a right-handed golfer, hit bunker shots with the toe in the sand. Why? Then 80 to 90% of the weight is on the left side. You must be on your left side to hit a bunker. The fact that you get to see that here at Eagle Creek in Orlando is testimony to the fact that this is some of the widest variety of golf in the entire country. We're at the beach. Didn't know there was beaches in Orlando, huh? Well, this is a newly constructed beach at Hawks Landing. We're with director of golf, Augie Decker. And Augie, 
I've had a long history with Hawks Landing. Love the course, love it even more now. You've made so many changes. So obviously we have the new Island Green here. It's an older golf course, so it's not gonna, you're not gonna get overpowered by yardage. Every once in a while, you're gonna have to use a little bit of imagination, an innovative shot, but that's what makes it fun. You really have to plot your way around, think your way around the golf course, um, really find the, the correct positions to leave your golf ball, to leave yourself an uphill putt. With our greens here, it's a little bit unique. We have the diamond zoysia grass, which is a little bit different from a lot of the courses here in Central Florida. Uh, more of a pure surface, um, no grain in it, so the grass goes straight up, and it's just a great result for your putts. So this very pretty golf course is actually a par 70. Absolutely. So guests might even shoot one of their lower scores. We're at the famous 18th hole island green. Chance to leave the course making a hole in one. I'm over my head talent wise. Director of golf, Augie Decker. We are ready, fire away. Another great shot. That's what we want, Tony. We want our guests to have fun and enjoy their round with us. So they certainly will at Hawks Landing, one of the more beautiful golf courses in the Orlando area. At Yingling, as America's oldest brewery, we've been doing what we love for nearly two centuries: brewing great beer that brings people together, like friends catching up at their favorite spot or getting together to watch the game, kicking back going out or going all out. Yingling Traditional Lager has been at the center of good times and we'll be there for the next round. Yingling to good times ahead. Imagine a golf ball with the grip of a tire. Well, that's what you get with Bridgestone's new E12 Contact. Because the new Contact Force Dimple uses contact science technology similar to Bridgestone's high performance tires, engineered to create 38% more contact at impact. For more distance and control, drive Bridgestone's new E12 Contact. Straight distance, driven by science. Huh, Ridgeback. Ridgeback, that's pretty cool. So it's a brace for the face. Ridgeback, like the dog. I don't know, I'm really a cat guy. So what is it? The best feeling and longest metal that you'll ever hit. Is that Bernhard? Oh great, Langer. <laughs> you know why I play Tour Edge? Because I win with it. Pound for pound, nothing comes close. Visitors who come to the state, they want to get wowed. This is really the place they should come. Kevin Woodard, director of golf, Southern Dunes one of the most renowned golf courses in the entire Orlando area. Well, the entire Florida area. <laughs> right. Every year ranked around the top 50 golf courses, public and private in the state of Florida, 1,200 golf courses. That's some pretty stiff competition. Tell me a little bit about how Southern Dunes got that reputation, starting with architect Steve Smyers. Perfect. Well, Southern Dunes, we started here. It opened in 1993. Um, this was an old orange grove that uh, they had lost due to a freeze. Just a, a simple dome that he created a lot of the undulations and the peaks in the valleys. Is, it's unlike Florida because there's a lot of undulation. There's uh, elevation changes, undulated greens. Obviously, you can see the sand dunes. So let's talk about these bunkers because they're massive. And they're pretty intimidating. A lot, of, a lot of the greenside bunkers have large lips to them. And then we have some fairway bunkers that are well over 200 yards long. A couple of the other features I like are these close mown areas around the green that allow for shot options. The short game with the collection areas, I mean, you can use the bump and run. You can use the high lofty shots. Every club in your bag can be used. And you keep these greens, they're Tiff Eagle. Mm -hmm. They are absolutely spectacular. You keep them about what speed all the time? Running uh, 10 to 12 yeah. on a stent meter. That is championship caliber. Yeah, absolutely. There's no question yeah. about it. <laughs> it's truly a masterpiece is what I would call it. Located 
on the western side, far western side of Orlando, and yet it's not that far away from anything. Tim Greco, general manager at Providence Golf Club, a very popular spot. We're actually so centrally located that we're just as easy to get to from Tampa as we are from eastern Orlando. We get a lot of play from Golf Pack Travel because of where we're located and how much fun it is to play Providence Golf Club. And what you're getting is something that has been evolving even though this is a fairly new course. Correct. We redesigned the golf course in 2018 to make it even more playable. It's wide open, very appealing to the eye, so it sets up nice when you're hitting your tee shot with confidence. The greens are now currently champion G12 greens. They, we don't have to overseed them, so we're maintained excellent conditions year round with no transitions. It's number eight right here, a very peaceful spot. Nothing around you, just take a deep breath, some nature, and obviously a very interesting hole with the creek meandering right in the front. The hole, it's our shortest hole on the golf course. We've enlarged the tee, we've enlarged the green. It's more receptive, but we've reworked it probably three or four times. And now I think we've got it right. A lot more birdies. And I guess that all rolls into your tagline. We're the hidden gem of Orlando when it comes to golf. We are at one of the most beautiful spots in all of Florida. Bella Kalina, and we're with Jim Kroll, director of golf, amazing property. It sits on a beautiful piece of land. Uh, the topography, the elevation changes are amazing, which really makes our golf course unique. It's a really a, kind of a mock-up of Tuscany with our beautiful uh, clubhouse and the surrounding dunes. And of course the wind out here when you're up on these hills, and that adds to the challenge of what is already a, a pretty challenging golf course. You can see like today the wind is blowing uh, very hard, so you're going to use every club in your bag. There are bunkers everywhere, and some of them are a little more benign than others, and some are, well, you just don't want to be in them. Yeah, we've got 83 bunkers on the golf course, and they're deep and they're big, and try to stay out of them. Really, it is a second shot golf course, so where you place your second shot on the green is extremely important so that you can avoid three putting. The greens are very large, they've got a lot of undulations to them, and so a two putt is a, is a good thing. Difficult, really a test, a consolation. After you go through all of the trials and tribulations here at Bella Kalina, maybe the greatest 19th hole in all of Florida. <laughs> <laughs> wow, what a view. The kind of views that Golf Pack Travel takes golfers to throughout the Orlando area. We've got managing partner Mark Bender with us. What we do specializes in creating great value for customers as well as delivering what we're known for, which is the best service and most important, making it easy for customers to plan their next golf vacation. You never pay more booking with us. We have a whole bunch of exclusive deals and we work with every property throughout the Orlando area. The newest portion of Bella Kalina, it's called Siena. Siena is a great option for customers looking to play Bella Kalina here in Montverde, Florida. Two and three bedroom, very comfortable units that are absolutely perfect for golf groups. And right down the street from the golf course that makes it even easier to enjoy this entire amazing property at Bella Kalina. When I was a kid, we used to hit golf balls off a bottle. You'd swing up on it, you could kill it, hit it forever. Well, now there's a teaching aid called the bottle tee. I launch it up in the air, it's going to go a lot better. Plus, my path is so much better with that ball sitting up there. It changes your mind's perception or the task of what the club has to do, which changes your swing. Head over to BottleTee.net. You'll get two bottle tees and two four yards more tees for $24.95. Free shipping now at BottleTee.net. Golfers, we're different. We aren't afraid to go for it. We're dedicated. And we never stop. Guys. Not every place gets us, but one does. Myrtle Beach, 78 courses, 60 miles of beach. You could say we were made for each other. The beach gets golfers. Golfers get the beach. Book your Myrtle Beach golf getaway today. Do you like Tour Edge? I love Tour Edge. This is seriously high tech. And they're long, right, Duff? Built in the USA? Oh, I love that. I need forgiveness! 
Did I mention these puppies are long? Really long. You know why I love Tour Edge? It's because I win with it. Pound for pound, nothing comes close. There is so much great golf in the Orlando area, but if you come on a golf trip, you're going to need a place to stay. We've got the man, Ruben Gonzalez, National Sales Manager for Magic Village. And these places are magic. They look pretty comfortable. We have amazing, luxurious, spacious homes with three bedrooms. Each bedroom has its own private bathrooms. You have a full kitchen if you guys want to either cook and you could just come and relax. And Magic Village is actually Magic Villages. Two communities very close to each other. The Orlando Kissimmee area, Magic Village Yards and also Magic Village Views. Both of them have the same type of accommodations. So this is great for families, golfers. The unit we stayed in during our trip had a huge sitting area outside on the porch with a great outdoor kitchen so you could cook, eat out there. It's about as good as it gets. It's magic. It's the magic village. Francesca Sparts, Director of Owner Relations for Global Resort Homes, or in short, person that golfers come to see. <laughs> Absolutely. So we actually manage a little over 300 homes right here in the Kissimmee Davenport area. Um, anything from a four bedroom townhouse to a nine bedroom single family home. They can grill, they can use the fully equipped kitchen inside. So most of these houses have game rooms they can enjoy and have fun with as well. Not only is it convenient and comfortable, but it truly adds value to the golf pack travel customers for them to have such a great vacation. So many options for golf in Orlando, so many options for housing. And we've got the guy who has more options than anyone, Nick Falcone, CEO, Encore Resorts and Spectrum Resorts. Tell us about your operation here. We're in great proximity to many of the great golf courses around. We're you know, right next to Reunion, which has the three signature golf courses. We're minutes from Champions Gate. Disney World, lots of options for golf, lots of options for fun. And right down the street, we also have our uh, entertainment retail district, Sunset Walk. We have 15 restaurants, live entertainment every single night. So for people, these golf groups, you know, they're looking for something aside from the golf. You know, when they come home, they have restaurants, they have amenities, services of a full service resort. So they really get the best of both worlds. That amazing accommodation where they could all be together under one roof. We've been receiving tremendous amount of groups from Golf Pack and they've been an amazing partner for us for the last few years. And I think that stems from the fact that we have a wide range and variety of products stemming from four to 13 bedrooms, which truly allows us to bring a lot of people together under one roof for an amazing experience. Now it's time to see where it all happens. We meet Carola Shorna, Director of Operations for Golf Pack Travel for 30 years. Golf Pack Travel has been booking custom golf vacations since 1975 and we consider ourselves to be the leader in the industry. Here in our call center, customer service is our number one priority and something we talk about every single day. Our sales agents have been with the company on average for 13 years. We have access to the best golf resorts in the country, the best golf courses. All our trips are refundable and there are no change fees. And our repeat customer rate is very high. We have more private homes in our inventory than any other tour operator in the world. We offer more than 600 golf courses at any price point from your daily fee to your private course to your bucket list golf course. Something for everyone. With ocean views like we have, our agents are in a great mood every time they pick up the phone. So contact us whenever you're ready to plan and book a golf vacation. We're ready for you. Here we are and all of the floodgates opened for air travel where people are getting more comfortable, people are getting vaccinated, people are going back to some form of normal life. And now is the time that if you're interested in taking a trip, especially one that involves golf, you want to book early. 
because properties are filling up like mad earlier and further in advance than ever before and you need to book six, eight, 10, 12 weeks in advance to get the inventory, the tee times that you want, the lodging that you want. And if you book with Golf Pack Travel, as you know, we're here to provide the best service, great value, and most important, we make things easy. Golf in the Orlando area runs the entire gamut. We want to invite all of you to see this area through the eyes of Golf Pack Travel, and we hope to see you again somewhere else along the golf trail.